Yo, Mr. C's, it's hot as hell out here, yo. I know, Angel. I know it's hot as hell out here. But we need to keep cooking. We need to get more subscribers. We're at 400 plus. We need to get more. So let's get back to cooking. Bitch, yo. Alright guys, I hope you guys enjoyed that that little movie that we created for you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, we got a bunch of goodie stuff that we brought from Albuquerque uh, that we're going to go and review. So let's head on over to the mall and check out what we got from Albuquerque. to see you really want to record this yes angel we need to record this like i told you we need to get 400 plus subscribers so let's get cooking whatever yo whatever floats your boat all right in three two one action what's going on guys we just get got back from shooting that little mini movie for you guys and we're gonna show you guys some goodies that we got out of Albuquerque. If you're not familiar with Albuquerque, is the place where the show got shot, where I lived for 10 years. Um, so we went and did the tour. You guys already saw those videos. So we kind of wanted to showcase what we brought back from the shops out there, souvenirs from Breaking Bad. So let's check out what we got. So we're gonna start with these really cool bobbleheads. I'm not a big bobblehead collector, but anything Breaking Bad, why not, man? Let's just go at it. Let's bring some goodies home for the display, for the store. Um, so yeah, that's why I picked up these. Um, I picked this, these out from our friends at uh, Cottonwood Mall. They, um, they have a Funko shop, but they get a lot of tourist people that come and check out the mall because of Better Call Saul was filmed at that mall, that Cinnabon that they record him in is actually in that Cottonwood Mall. So if you're going pop hunting, that's a really cool place to go see. They used it a bunch on season six. Yeah, we picked this out from Far Out Collectibles in uh, there in Albuquerque and Cottonwood Mall. I think I'm gonna open up Mr. Heisenberg so you guys can kind of check it out. Let's see what we got. So we got Walter White in here. Ooh, really nice packaging. Looks like he just got into a car wreck. But it's just a protector so he doesn't move. Pretty cool to see him. If you guys haven't seen the show, some clues in there. You guys got to watch the show if you haven't seen it. So that's one of them of the items that we picked up when we went down to um, to Albuquerque to do the Breaking Bad tour. And next we made it to the Candy Lady. 
We made it out to the Candy Lady store in Old Town in Albuquerque, New Mexico in Old Town. That's where her shop is located. And we picked up some cool, they call them beer mugs, I guess you can call them beer mugs. Um, but they look really cool. They come with the candy. Um, it's a cool little mug that you can get at that place. They have a bunch of them. They have a bunch of shirts. They have a bunch of good stuff in there. And she had some souvenirs, not souvenirs, but I, I would call them toys. So we picked up some like die cast RV um, pieces that she had in there. If you guys saw the that first video that we did about it, um, in there is where um, we go into the candy lady shop and found a bunch of goodies in there. I like taking things out of boxes. That one I believe I will never open as far as I think. But this one you can open. We're going to open it up so you can kind of see it up close. You can see like literally the, the containers in there that they use on the show. We weren't expecting to find that. We were just expecting to find a candy shop and we found some really cool things that will look good here and display in the store. Then we saw this, which is an Entertainment Earth exclusive. Old piece, she said when there was a Toys R Us there, they had those in there. And I believe they were going for like around 60 to $50 at that time. But now I've seen them go like hundred dollars plus it is uh, Gustavo Fring it's a, like an action figure toy um, that looked pretty cool and there he is with half of his face gone probably one of the best episodes that you need to check out comes with the tiny Boy Hermano's bucket. Key piece as well too on the show. So I thought that was pretty cool. Again, I'm always looking out to find unique pieces to display in my collection. So this was a really cool find. We found a bunch of, also too, she gave us a bunch of goodies when we were there. Um, she gave us um, some, of course, we got some of the candy from the show. Same stuff like this blue stuff in here. Uh, we picked up like a little postcard of Walter White, Boy Hermano stickers, an Eisenberg decal as well too we picked up. So those are some goodies that we found at the Candy Lady. And for our last goodie bag, we found a really, 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 really and I'm saying really, 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 because it was really, really, really cool. And you guys need to go out and check out this place in Old Town as well too. These guys are really, really cool guys. They literally have a whole section and room full of memorabilia and it's basically like a museum in there. If you guys didn't see that video, Go back to the other Breaking Bad videos because we showcase their store and we showcase the museum basically that they have there with photo ops and stuff like that. So it's something for sure that you guys gotta go and check out. They had a lot of goodies um, and they had a lot of cool stuff, but I, I've kind of been collecting these since I'm kind of complete with my Breaking Bad set. Um, so I've been collecting the U2s and they have some really cool um, Breaking Bad ones and uh, Better Call Saul uh, pieces. So I've been kind of collecting those and I'm gonna open them up so you guys can kind of see them. And then Better Call Saul too, if you haven't seen Better Call Saul, you need to watch it, it's really good. Season six, the last season is one of a kind season. So we picked those up from them. Um, and like I said, they're super good and friendly and they got really good customer service. So it's a place that you're going to enjoy if you enjoy the show. And if you want to check out some cool um, memorabilia and items from the actual show. So the U2s are pretty cool. 
They're very, very similar to Funko's, but they have their own little twist. So they're pretty cool um, items to find. And they had a large selection of them. I just kind of went light on what I picked up. But they have a really, really good selection of these U2's figurines. Um, and the details are pretty cool and pretty legit. Like you can see him, he's on the toilet there. Um, so yeah, it's, there's some pieces that I have out of the box in, our, in my personal display here at the store. That is something that you guys should uh, come and check out. And again, also pieces that we are going to want to start putting out on display. But yeah, this is kind of like all the goodies that we found in Albuquerque, New Mexico when we went to do the Breaking Bad tour. Again, if you didn't see that video, make sure you guys go and watch that video of us taking the tour of Breaking Bad. Um, and... Uh, well, actually, on um, some of these items here that we just showed you guys, we're actually going to be doing a giveaway. So we're doing a collaboration with our friends at um, the Breaking Bad store um, in Old Town. So we're going to be getting ready to do a giveaway on our Instagram. So stay tuned. The next video is going to showcase all the details um, for that giveaway. So stay tuned. Don't miss that out. And I kind of wanted to throw in a little bonus for you guys. A piece that I just picked up literally like a week ago in California. Shout out to um, Explosive Collectibles. We'll put their Instagram info. Uh, these guys are crazy collectors in California um, that had relationships with a lot of the, the actors from Breaking Bad. And they're also big Breaking Bad collectors. Um, so they got like super limited pieces. Um, like this is a pre-release Hot Topic sticker. And what he was telling me too, that you might find some out there and maybe some people put the sticker on there, but this one actually has the barcode sticker from Hot Topic. So that makes it even more legit. And of course it's signed certified. Uh, that is, um... That is the actor's signature. And also a cool thing that when I was checking out the box, if you notice that that gold speck from the marker where he signed in the front, well actually they're saying that he had ink on his hand and when he was picking up the pop, he basically did like his fingerprint on it as he was signing it. So you get a little bit of his fingerprint with this pop of of this actor, I can't remember his name, but he's a really good actor. Um, but yeah, it's one of a kind, unique piece that I have in my collection that is going in my case as well too. Um, so yeah, that was a little bonus and we are gonna be doing a giveaway. So make sure you guys stay tuned on this next video. We're gonna talk about how the giveaway is gonna work and how we're gonna collab with that other team. And we're gonna have some cool, activities for you guys to come and win some of these prices so stay tuned for that and um, make sure you guys are subscribed make sure you guys comment below if you collect any u2s if you have any memorabilia for breaking bad or what would you what which one's your favorite from all of these items that we have out um also some cute little bear bricks that i collect too i just brought those from home so you guys can kind of check them out um but yeah this is it this is what we got from albuquerque and we hope you guys like this video and we'll see you guys on the next video don't miss out they'll have all the details for that giveaway yo mr y you left your glasses oh <gasps> yo bitch